Hey guys, this is Iggy back again with Dragon Blogger. So, as a PC guy and a homeowner, I have a lot to worry about. I gotta keep the inside of my PC cool. I gotta keep the inside of my house cool. All keeping everything in a good price because AC isn't free. Neither is heating. In the winter, we gotta heat the house up a little bit. And then the PC's gotta keep all the cool air inside, you know, and exhaust the heat and all that stuff. So heat and all that stuff, heat and the cool, everything is expensive. It all takes power. So, you know, I've been looking around for, for something so that I can, you know, check the heat in my house, check the heat in my PC, the cooling in my PC, and I think I found it. So today I'm going to be doing an unboxing for the Seek Thermal, the compact. Now, the reason I'm holding up my Android phone, my Motorola Droid uh, Turbo, is because this is for Android. So it plugs into my phone, which I carry everywhere, and I might end up carrying this everywhere too. So aside from being good for the PC, potentially, sealed I don't know just yet, but so this is probably a great thing for contractors, people that do inspections, definitely or potentially PC enthusiasts, homeowners, people that do repairs on cars, on ACs, on ducting, pretty much everything that involves heat or cooling, which is about everything. So this, not this, this, it's got a 205, 206 by 156 thermal sensor and a 36 degree field of view. So you can see a pretty good area. Now, you, you're either maybe in Texas or Miami or Arizona that it's hot, or somewhere in the north, New Jersey, New York, Colorado, somewhere over there. It might be a little bit cooler, but still hot. It's summer and so everything's hot. But anyway, um, be it in the winter or the summer, this can detect temperatures negative 40 degrees Fahrenheit all the way up to 626 degrees Fahrenheit. So it can pretty much capture just about everything. And you don't have to be right on it to make sure. Now, mind you, the closer you are, the better, the more accurate it's going to be. But you can actually have a distance between you and what you're checking of 1,000 feet. So, and this does work in the day or night. So you're pretty good anywhere you put it. So anyway, let's go to an unboxing real quick and see what's inside. A little bit excited. All right, here she is. So pretty plain and simple in the front. Nice, sleek looking box. The side over here just kind of goes over, you know, all the uh, tech specs of it. Pretty cool. And then the back just kind of shows you a little bit of, you know, what the images are going to look like. And, you know, just goes a, a little bit over, you know, what it can actually do. And, well, this just marketing. Anyway, but it does give you a good example down here of how the little camera attaches to your phone. All right, so let's go ahead and open this guy up. This is a pretty complex little box. Okay, so there's an opening right over here. And I will mention that they package it very nicely. It feels like a very sturdy packaging. How does this open? Open right here. Instructions. <laughs> All right. So it's like a little book. That's pretty cool. All right. That's nice. So thermal imaging camera. You now have the power to see the unseen. Thermal imaging made easy for everyday use. Pretty cool. So shows you some more examples here. And again, just how it connects to your camera, to your phone, sorry. So can be used for security, heat loss, maintenance. Actually, I'll zoom in on that for you. Can be used for security, heat loss, maintenance, cooking, measurement, outdoors. So a few things. Security, this is actually a pretty cool thing. So you attach it to your Android phone and you record late at night, just put it somewhere stationary. Now, you're not going to see crystal clear picture, all in color and everything, because it's at night. But you will be able to see thermal imaging, you know, people walking around, all that good stuff. 
Obviously, as I explained before, you can detect the heat loss. The maintenance is kind of goes hand in hand with the heat loss and the cooling and everything. Cooking, that way you're cooking a burger or a hot dog or a veggie burger. You can see all the cool parts and just heat those up. Measurement for thermal measurement, of course, and outdoors, kind of basically on everything I just explained before over there. So I'm going to put the box down, and this has a little grip right over here. So I assume I just pull it out and put it down. Maybe, oh, I need to read sometimes. It tells you right at the bottom. Pull tab. Ah, okay. So I have to download an app. Attach Seek Thermal Sensor Camera. See the unseen. Very nice. So it says pull tab. I'm going to pull tab. Look at that. Look at that. If you read, reading is fundamental. All right. So look at this. So I'm going to skip the camera just for right now. All right. It brings a waterproof little bag here, or little container, should I say, and a keychain. So, yeah, right over here. Right here, you can attach it to your keys and put the camera right in here and just pop, pop, waterproof. Pretty cool. All right, again, I'm going to focus on the camera last just to see if there's anything else in this box. I'll tell you what, they really did a great job with this, with the packaging. All right, stop. Do not return to store. Please contact Seek Thermal Customer Service toll free at 844-C-HEAT or 844-733-4328 or email support. So they definitely want you to like it and of course, well, pay for support. So, all right, so here, oh, oh okay, I thought there was more in the back. Here is the camera itself. Teeny tiny camera, all right? Plugs in there. Now. As I already showed you, it does bring a waterproof carrying case. And as I explained before, it's perfect for finding air leaks, water leaks, structural damage, unsealed gaps, and insulation gaps. So pretty cool. Um, aside from structural stuff, it helps you find malfunctioning and overheating motors and components that waste a lot of electricity. We all have those, so that is pretty cool. And then Helps locate problems with your HVAC motors, generators, coils, compressors, fans, blowers, ductworks, registers, electronic connections, water leaks, water pipes, pumps, lines, valves, condensers, radio coils, transformers, and I can keep going because there's a lot of stuff this can actually help you with. So as you saw, or as I read to you earlier, lets you see the unseen. So what is, what is that? It lets you see heat, and it obviously lets you see cooling. So that, that's kind of cool too. Now, this particular one is for Android devices. Now, I will. there is also one for iPhones as well. So unfortunately, I don't have that one, but that's okay. So the way this guy's going to go is, now mind you, I have not downloaded the app. So hopefully it doesn't do anything bad, but just plug it right in here or actually sorry like that and there you go so let's see does it start I wonder if it auto senses anything one sec all right so I need, I definitely need to install the app so I will get back to you in one sec all right and then I'm going to go to that I had in my front All right, the Play Store. And Google Play, I just type in Seek. Seek Thermal right here. And just download and install the app. It's only nine megs, so depending on your internet connection, could be relatively quick or could take quite some time. 
my son and my daughter are playing online upstairs so it might take a little while but I'm almost done and I've only been talking for a few seconds <laughs> all right almost done here and there we go now it's installing all right so now I'm gonna open it all right let's take a few minutes to quickly walk through the basics of the app and learn how to use your device you can skip this at any time find help in the settings section swipe okay okay got it okay all this good stuff and I'll go through it a little bit later on all right and all right so now done oops so now let's just plug her in real quick all right it found it click OK and click go and let's just skip all this right now all right so you're getting to see all the stuff that, that you got to do all right it looks like if you're first time using your app with your seek thermal device you need to register all right give me one sec I'll be right back I need to register this all right now that I'm done registering mind you I haven't used this just yet I click up here compact all right I don't know what the clicking is just yet but see there we're seeing some thermals now you can see my hand pretty cool now obviously I'm not doing the review on video and actually you can see right up here tells you the temperature of what you're pointing at that's pretty cool let's see oh god that's hot anyway that's pretty cool now mind you there's a lot more to do with this than just you know scan your hand but anyway I, I just wanted to show you the beginning of it there will be a full written review and a few more videos I do on dragonblogger.com and on YouTube but anyway this was just an unboxing and an overview more coming soon on dragonblogger.com. This is Iggy again. See you guys.